The Law of Assumption by Neville Goddard was the first teaching the author received from the writings of Neville Goddard. It was the starting point for understanding the man's teachings, and the beginning of a life-changing experience that occurred when I applied this natural law to my own life. I had a block in my mind which refused to allow me to see the evidence of the assumption. I was walking the beach one day and the answer came to me. You will not become conscious of the unseen world until you consciously assume that which is denied by your senses. Once accept this statement, then use it in prayer throughout the day. Neville Goddard. This wonderful law turned my life around the very instant I understood the application of the law in my own life. It was the beginning of an awe-inspiring, awe-inspiring experience that continues to develop each day of my life. The law of assumption is the natural law by which the creative power of the mind brings into being the conditions, events and experiences which we desire. The principle is very simple. Whatever you assume to be true, with feeling, becomes your reality. There are two aspects or phases of the law of assumption. The first phase is the assumption of the wish fulfilled. The second phase is the assumption of the desire itself. In the first phase, the assumption of the wish fulfilled, you must assume that the thing desired is already yours. This may seem like an impossibility, but it is not. It can be done by assuming the feeling of having already attained the thing desired. You do not have to believe the assumption, the only thing required is the feeling that the thing desired is already yours. You may be surprised to find that the moment you assume the feeling of having attained the thing desired, the external evidence will begin to manifest. The second phase, the assumption of the desire itself, is the more common application of the law. In this phase, you simply assume the desire itself as an already existing fact. You do not have to feel that you have attained the desire, the assumption alone is sufficient. This phase is used when the thing desired is not yet in existence, but you believe that it can be brought into being by your assuming its reality. The law of assumption is the basic law from which all the other creative laws derive their power. It is the first step in the creative process, and the basis for all manifestation. The law of attraction, the law of vibration, and the law of growth all depend on the law of assumption for their operation. The law of assumption is the bridge between the conscious and the subconscious mind. It is how the subconscious mind is brought into contact with the conscious mind, and the power of the subconscious mind is put to the use of the conscious mind. The subconscious mind is the storehouse of all the memory traces of our past experience. It is the source from which the ideas and inspirations that lead to the realization of our desires are drawn. The subconscious mind is the seat of the emotions, and the law of assumption is how the emotions are brought into play. The emotions are the motivating force that impels the subconscious mind to action. The law of assumption is how the creative power of the subconscious mind is activated. It is the first step in the creative process. The law of assumption, applied intelligently, brings the right idea or the desired inspiration into the mind at the critical moment when it is needed. It acts as a magnet to attract the vibration corresponding to the idea or inspiration required by the individual who assumes that he has the desire. You must assume the feeling of the wish fulfilled, you must act as though the thing has already happened, and the external condition will change to correspond with the assumption. The external condition is merely the mirror that reflects the image held in the mind. If the image is that of poverty, the mirror shows poverty, if the image is that of riches, the mirror shows the reflection of the state desired. The law of assumption is the creative power by which the individual comes into union with the universal, it is the birthright of every human being, none are deprived of its benefits. You must simply assume the feeling or state desired, regardless of appearances in the external world. When the law of assumption is intelligently applied, it brings the right idea or the desired inspiration into the mind at the critical moment when it is needed. If the individual assumes the feeling of the wish fulfilled, the thing desired will follow. Download the free Manifesting Miracles Guided Meditation MP3 now. But first, please like and subscribe. Thank you.